Good afternoon. We're on the Euro USD here on ITM Genesis Elite, looking at a 25.88, roughly 26% probability of price staying inside this current boundary. Therefore, the likely choice here is an outside boundary trade. The probability of price exiting this this boundary is therefore fairly high. So we're going to choose the next available expiry time of 1700 and shoot for this outside boundary trade on the Euro USD, seeking a return of 75% on this trade. This trade will last uh, just under 30 minutes here. It's currently 16.36. We're now into the trade. I've zoomed in on the chart to show you uh, price more clearly here. We'll come back to you just before at expiry. All right, back again, roughly 12 seconds remaining on this EURUSD outside boundary trade due to expire at 1700. We see price having exited the boundary to the short side. That's the beauty of outside boundary trades. You don't have to worry about direction. You essentially need to exit the boundary. Up or down does not matter. It doesn't make much of a difference to the outcome. The outcome is positive whether you exit to the long side or the short side. So we've now expired for a $3,750 net return. And we're looking at another outside boundary opportunity here with price um, in a range where the probability of it staying inside that range is again very low. So we'll shoot for another outside boundary trade here, this time for a 15 minute expiry, the very first available expiry here. Um, on the EURUSD again, seeking a return of 75% on this trade. So we're now going to buy into this outside boundary trade. I'm going to zoom in on the chart as soon as this trade is in. So let's zoom in on the chart here, make price more visible. And we'll come back to you just before or at expiry on this second consecutive outside boundary trade on the EURUSD. All right, back again here, 24 seconds remaining on this your USD trade here on an outside boundary setup. This price has broken out more aggressively than the previous trade into the money here. We're about to expire here shortly for a positive return of 3,750 net on this trade. And we're also looking at another fairly high probability uh, outside boundary opportunity shaping up. Let's just let this trade expire here and the money and go back to the charts to see if we can manage another outside boundary trade here. So this has now expired, 3,750 netted on this trade and price has now just broken outside the analysis boundary. It should be returning to present us with a fairly low probability of staying inside this range, inside this boundary, as you can see there, under 5% probability of price staying inside this current boundary. Therefore, no time wasted. We're going to go for another outside boundary trade trade. Again, the premise being that since the probability of price staying inside the boundary is so low, the logical outcome there is an outside boundary trade. So we've gone into it, we've executed a $5,000 investment, and we're going to come back to you just before or at expiry to show you the results here. All right, back again here, roughly 23 seconds remaining on this Euro USD outside boundary trade. This too has exited the boundary, this time to the long side here. And we're now looking at this trade due to expire here shortly in the money for another $3,750 net return on this Euro USD outside boundary trade. Um, premise here has been simple all through and through. Once ITM Genesis Elite presents an opportunity where the probability of price staying inside the boundary is fairly low, the logical choice there is to go for an outside boundary opportunity in the sense that if price will not stay inside this boundary, it is very likely to exit the boundary. Very simple, nothing more to do here other than wait for price to enter that range, wait for the probability to present itself on the chart the moment the probability stays in that 25 or under percent, essentially the benchmark is 30 percent. Anything under 30 percent presents a valid outside boundary opportunity. The lower the probability of price staying inside that boundary, the higher your odds of succeeding in an outside boundary trade. Thank you.